Hello friends, today we are going to learn a program to shift 8 bit data 4 bit write and it is written that assume that data is in C register. So let's assume before execution C register is 25 H. So we have assumed this data. So in binary pattern 25 can be written as 0 0 1 0 is 2 and 5 is written as 0 1 0 1. Now what we need to do we need to shift this 8 bit data 4 times towards the right. Now what how we can do it there is no direct instruction to rotate the content of C register. That's why first we will copy this 25 inside the A register and once we get the value inside the A register then using RRC instruction we will rotate right we will rotate each and every bit towards the right without carry so after first rotation every bit will get shifted towards the right so this number will become 1 have we got 1 over here because once we rotate each and every bit towards its right then this lsb this lsb one will get shifted towards the most extreme left towards the msb position that's why after first rotation we got our number as one then this zero will be shifted towards the next position zero this zero will get shifted towards the next position zero then one then zero zero one zero so after first rotation we got our value like this this is 8 plus 1 9 and this is 2 so after first rotation our value became 92 h then one more time we will rotate using rrc why we are rotating second time because it is written that we need to rotate 4 bit okay towards the right that's why we need to rotate 4 number of times so after rrc rrc stands for rotate accumulator right without carry so this number will get shifted towards the right and so on that's why this last number will come at the first place and first digit will become 0 1 0 0 1 0 0 1 now this number has become 4 and this number has become 9 so after second rotation that has become 49 now one more time we will rotate towards the right without carry rrc stand for rotate accumulator right without carry so again this one will come towards the first position so this number will become one zero will get shifted towards the second position so zero one zero zero one zero zero now this number has become 10 this number has become 10 so 10 is a of hexadecimal and this number is 4 so now data has become a4 h every number is in hexadecimal format now one more time we will rotate towards the right so this number 0 will get shifted towards the left so this will become 0 1 0 1 0 0 1 0 now this number has become 5 and 2 52 h so after fourth rotation we got our answer as 52 h and before execution our content of accumulator or content of c register was 25 h so what is conclusion conclusion is that when we rotate any register four number of times then we get swapping of neighbor 25 will get swapped 5 will come at the place of 2 and 2 will come at the place of 5. So after rotating 4 number of times this number will become 52H. 25H will become 52H. So this program is for swapping the nibble. Nibble means collection of 4 bits. Nibble means collection of 4 bits. So this 5 is 0, 0, 1, 0 and last nibble is 0, 0. One zero. So this is our technique. First, we will take that data inside the accumulator. Then we will rotate it four number of times. So let's do this.
let's say before execution content of c register is 25 h and we started our program from 7000 h and very first instruction that we wrote is mov a comma c now because of this the content of c register will get copied inside the a register and before execution c was 25 therefore after execution a will become 25 h now this instruction is of one byte that's why it will take only one memory location of program then we need to rotate towards the right four number of times so four number of times we will write rrc 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 so we know that after fourth rrc our accumulator will become 52 h so here swapping of nibble is done 25 h has become 52 h now but this value is in a register but we want our final answer in c register that's why finally we will move the content of accumulator inside the c register by writing instruction mov c comma a so value of a will get copied inside the c value of a was 52 h therefore after execution of this instruction c register will become 52 h so we successfully rotated the content of c register four number of times and that's why we will write instruction hlt or rsp1 to stop execution of the program thank you